Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to install Singularity to your Fire Stick or Android TV. The whole process is super easy and will take you only a couple of minutes. First of all, we'll have to get an app called Unloader. You can actually get it for free from the official Amazon App Store. Just go to search on your device, here it is, and in the search bar, start typing Unloader. As you can see, there was even no need to enter whole name of the app because Unloader has already popped out for us at the bottom. So we click on Unloader. And that's the app which we need to get to our device. But after you get the loader, it's not over yet. We still have to set it up. And to set up the loader, we'll go to settings. So here they are, open them, then scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Open it. Here we'll have to enable developer options on your device. However, on some Fire Sticks and especially on the new ones, the developer options can be hidden by default. So if that's the case, do not worry, it's really easy to make them appear. Just go to About select Fire TV Stick, and now you have to click on the middle button on your remote for 7 times, and do it fast, so let's do it. As you can see, now the button for me says no need, you are already a developer, that's in my case. In your case, it's going to say that you have become a developer now. And if you go back a bit, you will see developer options, which have appeared right here. So we open them, make sure to enable ADB debugging, then go to install unknown apps, and here, turn that option on for the loader. So what it does is going to allow us to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those which are available in the official Amazon App Store. And that's exactly what we're going to do right now. So now let's go to the list of apps on our device. Here it is, open it. And there you'll find the downloader application, which we just got to our device. However, before actually using the downloader, there's one more thing which I really recommend doing. It's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they're not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month. In the VPN app, you just connect to any server. Let's say I will connect to Denmark right now. And from the moment we connect, all our internet traffic is going to be totally encrypted. It means nobody can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you wish to stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you'd like to try it out, I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below the video or in the description of the video, you'll get 3 months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN. Or just scan the QR code which you can see on your screen right now with the camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you 3 months of NordVPN for free. And now finally, let's use the loader safely. So we open the loader app. On the left side menu, make sure to click on home, that's important. And here in the search bar, we'll have to enter a link, which is going to be singler.com. So let's enter it. Excuse me, it's not .com, it's .net. Yep, sorry, singler.net. So here's the link which you have to enter. Make sure to enter it exactly as you see on the screen and do not make any mistakes. Then just click on go. And the website of Singular is going to open up for us. Then we just scroll down a little bit until we see the download APK button. Let's click on it. And now the download of Singular has started. Click install here. After that, do not click on open yet. Instead, press on done. Here we have an option to delete the installation file as we do not really need it anymore. So we click on delete and then delete once again. After that, let's go to the settings once again. Here we are. My Fire TV, developer options, install on apps, and turn that option on for the Singular installer because it's a must so we could install the Singular app correctly. After that, let's go to the list of apps on our device, open it, and there we got the Singular installer. It's not the full Singular app yet, but soon we'll have it on our device. So we open the installer, and now the download of the full Singular app has started. It might take quite a bit if you have a slow connection. Click OK here, and you have to allow access to files on your device so you could install the Singular app. Then click on Install and wait until Singular gets installed to your device. 
and now it has been successful so let's go back to the list of apps on our device scroll down and here you'll see two Sinclair logos so one of them is installer that's the one on the left and the right is the full Sinclair app so we don't really need the installer anyway so let's delete it so it wouldn't take space on your fire stick so delete okay and now we are left with the good Singular application. Feel free to open it and use the way you intend to. Hope the video was helpful. If it was, make sure to click on the like button and see you next time. Bye bye.